good morning guys welcome to today's video today it's all about big huge messes just joking but basically my dining room table is always a big huge mess because Sophie plays here often and messes happen These are what they're from. they also do homeschool here which also makes for big messes the girls are eating these oranges a lot though uh oh I need a bigger bowl so basically, uh, we went shopping last night. I don't have any footage. Gabby, Sophie bought a bunch of toys. You may recently have seen uh, that Sophie got a lot of money for her birthday, mostly gift cards actually, and she spent them yesterday. So we went out for supper and just had some relaxing time without the vlog, and it was really fun and relaxing. But anyway, today we're ready to get up there and go back out and live our lives. And we want you guys to come with us. Stay, stay, stay. Ah! Stay. Stay. Okay, okay go. Okay. All right. We are talking above zero. It's like already 14 degrees. 14 degrees already, you guys. It's going to be a warm one. Blankets off? Yep, all blankets off. When we get to the bar boys farm, we're going to take blankets off them, but let's feed them while we take off blankets. Are we riding today? We are riding. Today is uh, what kind of day is it? On. What kind of a day is it? Day. Today's the day, Penny. Today's the day. I'm releasing you to the horses. Please do not disappoint me. Please do not stress me out. Alright, so while she eats her breakfast, I have my handy dandy washcloth. So, some people are I'm misunderstood what I meant about her peeing all down herself. It's not because she has any weakness anywhere, it's because she's in heat. And last night when I came down to wash her, she had so much grossness. Like, it was so thick, it like was butter. It was that gross. Before last night, it, it seemed like it was starting to get better. She's starting to get like less in heat. But oh man, yesterday was a gross day. So anyway, I bring up my washcloth down and I wash her every day and I put Vaseline on her to try and help her get through this heat stage. All right, I got all the Vaseline on her. She's like Vaseline because the pee is rot is is starting her skin to break down. But she's been like four days maybe in heat. Today's the day. My pony is getting scalped. You just think well, how... I need her to put her head down. Put your head down. That's the whole thing. I need her to put her head down in my ride. Ah, put your head down. You're okay. So a little bit of me thinks that Penny is a bit of a spoiled we girl. We can't do this with her head up. Put your head down. Here. Like not framing. So we if you had a treat, she'd put her head down. So cut on an angle down. Uh huh. But I have to cut down up. Why? Because I can't do that when her head's up. Like it's not how it's gonna be. So it's gonna be uneven. Mm. But she puts her head. Well, she, I can't do she always has her head up. So. Oh, stop it! Stop it! Oh, there's better scissors here. Oh, I like what you're doing, Gabby. You're good at that. So all she's doing is just trimming off the the loose, the rough edges. Because I want her hair to be a little bit long. I don't want, like, a short hair pony. She's just trimming them. So I touch them more. Yeah, I do touch them. She does get better the more you tell her not to do it. To and I don't mean be day. mean. Yeah, like, she, you just have to be kind, but, like, be in bo the boss of her, and she does better. Today, when I get to ride Penny, I want to try riding her in a, in a new bit. Then ride her in the arena first. Yeah, I'm going to. I mean, no bit. If the bit doesn't work for her, it's not going to be any different than what I'm used to anyway. This just feels good, Pen. can go without the hair getting messed Yeah. We're just making you beautiful. We're making you ours. I think, look, at, way up here, there's this big piece. Is that her... Mane? We'll let it grow. Oh. Alright. I, I think her mane looks really bad. Her mane looks bad? Did Hard you do this part of her mane? No. Should you? If it normally goes to that side, so if I cut it, it's just going to that side. It doesn't even need to be cut. It okay. Alright, that's good. I'm going to go get stuff ready for her. Alright, so Sophie's going to leave my mare out today because I want to get this on video. Just take her down there and take her for a walk. Do you want me to take her? Sophie, you, Gabby, you let her go too. Okay, watch out! This is the slime. Don't. What are you doing? Try not get smushed. 
<laughs> Crazy. She's like, whoa, I can run! I've been dying to see this place! Oh, she's going to roll. I betcha. I don't want to be out here when you charge it. Yeah, I stand up against the tree. She doesn't know about fences yet, so... She stood there for 10 days looking out that gate, planning her escape, planning where she's going to go. There goes Gracie rolling. <laughs> Don't roll now. You might need to move in a fast way, Gracie. She doesn't understand the electric fence yet. I'm hoping that she'll just get a couple of shocks right now and that she, will, that she won't go through it, that she'll go backwards. Here she comes. Or tore something in my leg trying to run. <laughs> I don't know what you were doing. All you should have done is backed away. Taken it off and backed away. Instead you walked in the path of her. I was trying to run. Uh-oh. Well, she likes the backfield. Yeah, there's hay there for you. She's on alert. She knows it's happening. She likes to be on her own, she said. She likes to do her own thing. Which would be great. If Willow lets her. I feel like she's gained a tiny bit of weight. You see a little bit of junk in the belly. So for any of you guys who think that this paddock is w way too small for her. In Canada, we do something that's called a winter paddock. Which is always smaller. Always muddy. It's to save our fields. And this is a fine size winter paddock. In the past, you guys have been able to see three giant horses running at full speeds through this paddock. Not full speed. Okay, running in this paddock. So she will have... Why'd you touch it then? Oh, great job, Gabby. She touched it! Her Why'd out. you take her up by the fence? So she can eat. Oh. No, she came back. I was like, no. Aw, she's all talk and no action. That's, no, that's Gracie. She's, she's a major suck up. <laughs> oh, Gracie looks good, actually. I was worried that she's getting too fat still. Like, she's a major suck up. All right, well, so far, I remember going to roll. Says, like, like, okay, good. I want to see her roll. She's fun to Gracie, do not roll. Gracie, don't charge her while she's rolling. I want to see her roll. Gracie doesn't have the guts to do that, though. So what happened is that she got too close to the fence, Gracie, and got a shot. Pretty, pretty Penny. My pretty clean Penny is not going to be clean anymore. <laughs> she just falls down dead. Oh. Oh, she's counted. Yeah, she's talented. I want to avoid her getting overweight. Horses that are overweight tend to be like harder to get going and... Oh! Gracie's circling. Do they have nine uh -oh. oh. Oh, remember the fence is there! <laughs> she's happy! <laughs> like that was and playful! Yeah. Look at how cute! Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> Mom, what the heck are you doing? <laughs> I'm scaring everybody. <laughs> I want her to touch the fence. Why do you like Don't roll, jump. Mom. I mean, if you turn into a jumping horse, I'm good with that. But don't jump. Yeah, she's muddy now. If she jumps, she would jump. Aw, say hi to her. Good girl. Look at that, Gabby. She's like, I want this. If you knock her over, you all oh, look at she's so much more affectionate than I ever thought she'd be. She likes humans more than people. Humans are people. <laughs> she likes humans more than horses. Gracie doesn't seem that stressed out either. Like getting letting them get to know each other has had some benefits for sure. Things are going well so far, but now is time to release the beast. We're releasing the beast. I put hay in the arena too for any horse that's feeling. Mm -hmm. Well, that's one that's gonna run through Okay, well they've lost a little bit of weight. That's good. She's like, oh, crap. <laughs> Don't, Gabby. She's protecting Gracie. Just let them interfere on their, let them do it on, I'm worried about that pole in the middle of the arena. I couldn't get it out. I need Sam to take it out. He told me to take it out and it's not going out. Uh-oh, she knows. She knows Willow's the boss. Well, not much has changed here. We're so dysfunctional, but still inseparable. Yeah, we just never get it.
I promise one day she will be a friend okay promise this isn't just for I feel like Willow's kind of lost without a big horse in her field she she really I mean she came from a mini farm but she she likes her a big horse We cleaned up the barn. Girls have gone up to start school because we, like I said, we have to go to the other barn and nothing has happened. Willow hasn't even moved from her spot of hay. Obviously, bad things happen when. Oh, hello! Come here! Not you. Not you. I want the kitty. Oh, pretty girl. Fortunately, I can't crouch down very well because uh oh uh oh uh oh my balance is not so good hold on I want to love you there we go right here on her chin see the little black spot yes you were pretty girl a tick I think it's a tick I think you have a tick and I'm gonna get it off you we have a little tool it pulls them right off. Okay, I'll get it off you. Is it bothering you? She's so happy. She's so happy. Yeah. What a pretty girl. Oh my gosh, this is not your best self, Penny. This is not the horse I ordered. This is not the horse that I bought. What the heck? Can you guys see? She is now brown and white. I told you I wanted a brown and white horse. So now I have a brown and white horse brown and white. I'm going to go get some more of the hay. It's already dry. It's not even wet. Oh, you dirty girl. I'm going to bring some more of the hay down here because clearly she likes to be on her own, which I don't, I'm, I respect that. I respect that, Penny. And Gracie's loving the indoor. Gracie's like, I'm not going to be in all the drama. I know it's going to happen when you guys leave. She's inside. All right, so are you guys ready? Are you guys ready for another Penny Miracle? I have a few, actually. A few Penny Miracles. One, she is such a lovely horse, you guys. She's so sweet, kind, and lovely out there. I don't know where Willow is at the moment, but there has been, I've been watching all day, and there has been zero aggression in this little herd. Zero. She has been getting to know Gracie a little bit. They've been standing kind of smelling each other from, from afar, kind of. They've just been hanging out. She's been a dream. They've, it's been awesome. Never before in life have I ever introduced horses before and had that reaction. She's lovely. She's beautiful. Her owner, her old owner, honestly, everything she told me about this horse has been so accurate. And that doesn't happen very often. Like... Lots of times owners say things to make you buy the horse, but she wanted the horse to go to a home that loved her. She wanted the, the owner to be 
she wanted me to be completely informed and oh my gosh it's lovely but here is miracle number two this is a huge one article a saddle fitter is coming through here in a couple of weeks so i booked him to come then i realized that he only shows he only does english saddles he doesn't do western then i realized that finding a saddle fitter for a western saddle is going to be impossible so then I realized, oh my gosh, here I am again, not able to get a saddle. So today I did a bunch of research and tried to figure out uh, what saddle would be good for me. I need a saddle that's built specifically for a gated horse. Kind of has like a cut out in the front so that they can move their shoulders more and move their head up and down. And it was a disaster. I have so much trouble looking and trying to find something that I don't know enough about. Um, but finally I came across one that was a brand that I know our tax store sells. So then I thought, well, since our tax store already sells this brand, why not call them and see if they can order this specific one in that is made specifically for gated horses. And I'm, <laughs> I'm shaking my hand up and down as I, as I talk to you guys and she, she was doing it back to me. It was so funny. She's such a cutie. How did you get up here? <laughs> Anyways, so, okay, this is the miracle part, you guys. Get ready. Don't skip ahead. Listen to this. So, I took a screenshot, and I sent it to one of the girls that works at the tech store, and I said, is there any way you could order one of these saddles in for me? And she said, Laura, you're not going to believe it. I'm unboxing this exact saddle right this second, and she sent me a picture. So, this is the picture that she sent me. This is the saddle. They just clearly unboxed it. It still has wrapping paper on it. Um, it is beautiful see how it's kind of got a different thing in the front here for gated horses it's totally the color i like i love the saddle like i'm really picky about saddles i love it i it's like it's everything that i want in a saddle it's so weird it's like god picked penny from the sky and dropped her in my lap she's exactly what i wanted and this saddle is is pretty much exactly what i want and it's for gated horses like what are the chances that i would find a saddle and screenshot it and send it to the tag store the second that they are opening the saddle at their store like that's insane and and the fact that they even ordered a, a, tri a saddle for a gated horse so the only problem is is that it is twenty three hundred dollars plus tax twenty three hundred dollars plus tax i spent way more on my kids saddles though this i'm buying it like sam i'm sorry if you're editing this i'm sorry but i'm buying this saddle <laughs> if it fits, if it works. So I sent her a message and they said I could just take it home and try it on her and see if it works. And then if it works, I can just pay them. But I don't feel comfortable doing that. Even though it's made for gated horses, I need to like have somebody put it on and make sure that it fits correctly before I buy it. So I'm probably gonna have to figure out a time that I can take her there and let them try it on her. Um, Cause they do that at, at that tech store. with his ribbon looking cute oh he wants a kiss look at how cute he is too bad he couldn't wear it around his field so everybody knew that he was a sixth place ribbon boy all right there's chino bambino he's like i did all that stuff at the show and i never ever even got to see my ribbon that's your ribbon this is gabby's first show ribbons they go over a horse's neck and she really likes and them they're derby ribbons they're like exclusive yeah to derbies. are they exclusive to derbies like mainly only derbies or equitation oh that's cool like chino it's your ribbon look there's a yam on the So Gabby has her new backpack I don't know if you guys caught this but she won a hundred dollars in cash and 
she won this backpack from the tax store. It cost $78. So she won like $178 basically at that show. And it cost her $30 for the one horse. Like that's how amazing it was. So it's this really nice backpack. Then it's got this spot here for her helmet. And long ago when we first got Sabrina, way back when, I don't even know if this person's even following us anymore. I'd Probably not. But she got this helmet cover. It's insulated. And it has her first letter of her name monogrammed on it it's a g sophie has one too and if she gets a new helmet for christmas which is what she's asking for then she will have to use it too look at this you guys you see it Jiggle. that is a honking muscle right there look at this one it still jiggles there, it. Though. well muscles jiggle a little it's hard it's hard he feels hard. Holy heck. That head. is a big muscle. Holy. So all the jumps are gone. There's nothing in here. The girls are just going to do a flat lesson. Or not a lesson. They're going to do a flat ride. And they're going to work on something else. What are you going to work on, Sophie? Um, going flat. And? I'm not doing a Well, guess what, sister? You might as well get used to it before your lesson because Brandon's going to make you. Oh.